I bought this uh, Sekonic L358 light meter uh, as I wanted to have a light meter that would be rugged and reliable and be able to withstand use both inside the studio and outside doing things like weddings and uh, uh, portrait photography outside. Essentially the light meter has a large display here uh, where all of the functions are visible. This is the on off switch, the AV or EV button, two ISO buttons so that you can select uh, predetermined ISO readings. It has a mode button for selecting the various options within the light meter and a memory button to display memory readings. This is a large jog button for changing features within the, the display and this is the button on the side here for actually taking the light meter reading. On the back of the light meter you have the battery compartment which holds the battery here and then you have a series of dip switches here which can be used to change various functions within the light meter. This slot here takes a small RF transmitter and is extremely useful as this means you can use it in the studio without a cable uh, attached to your, uh, to your flashlights. On the top of the light meter you have the Lumisphere which retracts so it doesn't get damaged and you'd use this and I'll explain this in a future video but you have also another uh, device which fits on the top here very easy to remove you just push that down take it off that's actually the light cell itself and you can put that on there for other features this device will spin so that you can take meeting uh, readings from uh, different points of view jolly good light meter I bought this particular one on eBay uh, second hand and it's been very reliable hasn't let me down yet